Hi Twin Flamers, welcome to your reading and this is the update on the Twin Flame journey. <clears throat> if you resonate with the reading, that's good. Congratulations. If you do not resonate at all, you can check other readings, my Twin Flame journey readings. It's actually in the archive. <clears throat> If you resonate with some bits and pieces, that makes sense because I am doing a collective reading. All right. Let's start with the reading by getting a overall energy. This is the DF and this is the DM's overall energy. The DF's feelings towards the DM and the DM's feelings towards the DF. The past, the present, and the not so distant future, and the foreseeable outcome. All right, let's check. Treasure Islands and Son of Pentacles. The DF is slowly moving to her abundance slowly moving towards her love for herself <clears throat> the df is somehow as you can see here slowly yet regaining power regaining her power back and there is something in df's carrying it's more of self-love, pride. I feel like pride because she didn't regret this connection, even though that there is some sort of, um, you know, flaws and hardship because the DF gave her all, right? Gave her all. <clears throat> Let's check the DM's overall energy and feelings towards the DM. Why? The DM is also working on his abundance, money, coins, pentacles, whatever you want to call it. But the DM is asking why? Why? Are you moving away? Why energetically I am not feeling you anymore? Why energetically you are I am not why energetically you are far from me? Alright. The feelings towards the DF is abundant as well. The feelings towards the DM you only have few left. Right. <clears throat> Let's check here what happened in the past. Three of Pentacles. Let me just clarify this first. Ace of Pentacles and Wheel of Fortune. All right. I think in the past, someone studied someone or let's say someone asked someone out um this connection happened through common friends you met with you, you don't technically know each other there's a common friend that introduced you to each other someone has someone was attracted and you know gave the intention of hey <clears throat> I like you kind of it happened so fast okay I believe that both of you traveled far from each other and you met in a specific place in a specific event and it just happened okay it's it's magic it magically happened the present here the death card someone someone in this connection their feelings 
is fading away. I want to clarify that because someone's stressed out. Someone's stressed out because of long distance connection. Someone is stressed out of why this feeling or why this connection happened so fast. It could also be the question of the DM, why it happened so fast. Someone's questioning why you're not calling me anymore. We don't talk anymore. We don't talk anymore like we used to do. Someone's stressed out. Someone is thinking what is happening with with my twin flame what is happening what are they doing right now i think this is the dm could also be the df but the this is more of the masculine side i think because of the df is kind of you know moving away the dm wanted to talk now stressed what are you doing stressed what what are you up to it's here let's see it's a the not so distant future eight of cups someone will really leave someone someone will really leave someone i want to clarify this all right death card is evident here which means something happened quickly as well someone already have an option an option doesn't really have to be a specific a person option perhaps could be a hobby work career money um passion family friends someone is focusing their cup or their attention to a different cup okay take it as you will it could be a person or it could be those um those things that i mentioned earlier and something is really fading here someone is really leaving someone like what I mentioned earlier, the DF is focusing on herself, on her career, on her pentacles, on her bank account. And there's nothing wrong with that. Especially if... Here's the thing. When a person gives them all, which the DF... Um, I, I can see the DF gave 110% or even more um, herself into this connection. And when that person, you, you, you kind of like getting used to it, you kind of like getting comfortable that this person is, will give you everything. It feels like it's a responsibility for them that it should be given to you. So, um, I feel like you're you feel like you're privileged that this person needs to do it for you okay now if this person has already their enlightenment and when they're moving away because they're not getting what they deserve now you find the value of that person why it's always like that I think that's the law of the universe um, let's see what is the foresee or the foreseeable future or the possible outcome ace of cups a huge amount of love let's double check and another ace of cups Will this be a person? Justice will be served. For some, the DM will really chase the DF. For the DF who don't want to be in this connection anymore, 
may find love to others and may find love to herself. Okay. Um, sometimes it really needs to, you know, break something or someone, I mean, you need to be shaken for you to realize that that person is for you. Sometimes that thing should be lost for you to, re to realize its value, right? Because if it's just hanging there, you're not going to miss it. If it's just hanging there, you know, you, you might just walk over through it, pass it by, I mean, pass that thing by, you know, and because it's there, now it's gone or slowly moving away, you're not kind of used to seeing that thing with, I mean, without, I'm trying to, you, you catch the drift, right? Let's say if there's a specific vase or there's a specific vase on your, um, on the table before you leave the house, you will not pay too much attention to that vase right especially if you put your keys on the on the vase your car keys on the butt uh, on that vase right however one day if you're gonna go out and you'll just see your you, you just see your keys there without the vase that's the time that you realize wait there's something missing there's something's gone right you're gonna find the value of it. You're gonna find, you're gonna pay much attention of it. Catch the drift, okay? So, yep, that's kind of thing. I think the universe is giving this situation to make someone realize that they are valued that and for also this person who gave everything is i mean to put love on herself as well all right um i forgot to bring out the romances angels so give me a quick sec i'll just get it and oopsie what's that What's that? Alright, um, I'm gonna get it here. There you go. Let me shuffle it for you. <coughs> yeah, because I cleansed the cards earlier. Let's check what are the angels will say. Le I'm gonna get two, three, three. Um, it may be a, it can be an additional message. It could be someone just needs to hear it. Could be also your overall energy or an advice. One, two, three. Flirt. Extend your light-hearted energy to others. I think it's it's time for the DF to go out. However with this kind of situation that we are having right now you cannot go out well could be there's an online um dating site that you want to join try to flirt i don't know is the angels telling you Ex just extend yourself to someone don't focus don't focus yourself to someone 
extend it. You, I mean, there you go. I got it. Someone might probably give you the attention, the love that you deserve. Okay? It is safe for you to love. I think the DF is, you know, having questions with people anymore, right? I mean, having questions with people now because of what happened. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. It's here. So do not, there's still good people out there. Okay, there's still people who can give you the love that you deserve. And another one is engagement. Your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. You might gonna get this probably someday. The angel's trying to say is probably after this, you know, global situation that we are encountering, you might wanna get out, go, go out rather. Go out, trust people again, and you might gonna get an engagement. It's here, okay? More of the story. Know your words. And I think the, DM, the DF already has an enlightenment. That's why she's moving away from this connection. And I think the DF is trying to fill her empty cups by her own and it's hard to do and another moral of the story is value the person while it's there because you might not gonna get a chance to tell what you really feel when they're gone So if you resonate with this, click the subscribe button, smash that notification bell, and comment down below. I'm very interactive. Thank you so much for watching. Love and light to you. See you on the next reading, Twin Flamers. Goodbye.